Hello everybody and welcome to Hapsan Zina 2 Unbreaked Again video. This video is sponsored by Velofred.com, quality bicycle accessories online store. Recently Hapsan issued an update and to make long story short, I could not update uh, my drone using the smartphone. I watched multiple videos. Uh, read tutorials but nothing worked i know you want to fix it okay let's do it you need a checklist first for this project we will need fat32 formatted sd card we need a computer we need a micro usb cable to connect drone to pc we need a xeno 2 upgrade tool version 4.0.7 xeno 2 firmware 05.11 all the links are in the description below. Step 1. Using Xeno 2 PC Upgrade Tool. If you've never done this, I strongly recommend to watch Firmware Upgrade Hubson Xeno 2 tutorial on the official Hubson YouTube channel. If you don't want to watch that tutorial, uh, you have to plug in the cable press that square button on the top and start your drone it will automatically connect to your PC on the PC you have to open AMBA USB software uh, it looks like this uh, you're making sure that you have the correct drone selected from the drop down list uh, you need to find the elf update file as it described in the tutorial and then you find the configuration file uh, on the top uh, i think this update is for gimbal only because when i check the upgrades so it looks like only gimbal was affected by this update once everything is done verify everything is correct uh, correct drone everything is ready uh, press that blue arrow and wait for the update to load onto your drone uh, when it's done it should say uh, success it goes pretty quickly uh, status is success everything is good uh, we are ready to move to the next step step number two I installed Xeno 2 firmware 5.11 at this point you have to format your SD card uh, FAT32 is recommended by the tutorial I didn't object I didn't use extended FAT I found a smaller card and formatted to 32 gigs. Uh, it's 16 gigs total. Uh, once formatted, you have to unzip your files with IT package and PW package. Uh, once unzipped, uh, you take IT uh, file inside of it. There's only one file, umbasysfw.bin. You put it in the root of your uh, SD card. Uh, then for PW you need to do a little trick uh, and you need to create a folder and call it exactly as uh, it is written there I have it in the description below and then you have to copy three files which you find in the upgrade to your SD card so verify everything is correct have the folder name uh, have the IT file in the root everything is good so we're going to the upgrades. My SD card is already inserted. I'm starting the drone. I'm still interested in what that ELF file is for. If you know the answer, please comment below. Otherwise, you can uh, watch the LED status uh, during the upgrade for another 3 minutes and 26 seconds. 
uh, this video is continuation of QC guy video where he shows how he loads the restore firmware uh, get his Xeno 2 out of the bricked status otherwise if you're impatient you may fast forward uh, to the end of the video see the results uh, please let me know in the comments below if you got the same results as I did Okay, and we are done. Uh, let's check the results. Uh, version 122, everything looks great. Controller is 115. Uh, aircraft, uh, as you can see, update PW072. IT is 067 and gimbal uh, 43. Thank you for watching like share and subscribe you know the deal good luck with your update